To get into our data, we have 249 new cases today. I want to thank the entire team of people that contribute to us evaluating these cases as well as identifying them. Our total number of positive tests is now roughly 10,800 out of the 85,000 tests that we have done as a state. There are 312 people currently hospitalized. Of these, 71 are currently in the ICU and 52 are currently on a ventilator in the intensive care unit. Sadly, we have 11 additional COVID-19 associated fatalities to report. Two of these people were in their 50s, six of these people were in their 70s, two people were in their 80s, and one person was in their 90s. These 11 people included one person from the Rhode Island Veterans Home, in addition to the two fatalities at the Vets Home that we sadly announced yesterday. The passing of these people and the people we have lost in the last several weeks is incredibly challenging and hard for the families involved. That's why it's important that we send out our hearts and prayers to them.